Have you ever wondered how your computer works? It's like a magical box filled with millions of possibilities, isn't it? Today we are going to unravel that magic and explore the world of software and hardware that makes up a computer. To start, think of your computer as a busy city. The hardware would be the physical infrastructure of that city, the buildings, roads, bridges, and power lines. It's the tangible, touchable part of the computer. This includes the computer's hard drive, central processing unit or CPU, memory and input-output devices like your mouse and keyboard. The software, on the other hand, is like the people, the activities, the businesses, all the things that make the city run. It's the intangible part, the programs and data that the computer processes. This includes everything from your operating system like Windows or MacOS to the applications you use like Microsoft Word or Google Chrome. Now imagine the hardware as a theater stage. It's set, it's solid, it's ready for action. But without actors and a script, it's just an empty space. That's where the software comes in. It's the actors, the script, the performance that brings the stage to life. Together, the hardware and software interact in a complex dance. The software sends instructions, the hardware executes them, the software asks for data, the hardware provides it. Without one, the other wouldn't function. It's a symbiotic relationship, each relying on the other to create the dynamic experience we know as using a computer. To simplify, if you were to send an email, the software, your email program, would create the message, format it, and send it off. The hardware, your computer's network card, would then take that message and physically send it out into the internet to be received by the recipient's computer. In summary, your computer is a marvel of modern technology, a combination of tangible hardware and intangible software working together in harmony. The hardware, like a city's infrastructure or a theater's stage, provides the foundation. The software, like the city's activities or the theater's performance, brings the computer to life. Together, they create the dynamic, versatile machine that we use every day. Next time you sit down at your computer, spare a thought for the intricate dance happening inside that box. It's not just magic, it's a marvel of human ingenuity.